Hello, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Please ensure to like, share, and subscribe. And also click the bell notification in the top right hand corner to be made aware anytime I upload tutorials or videos to YouTube. Alright, let's craft together. Hey guys, today I am going to be walking you through utilizing a PLR 2024 digital calendar template. This template comes to us from Precious Delights for You on Etsy. I will link her in the description of this video tutorial or her shop in the description of this video tutorial. And I'm using her template in conjunction with some slogans from Creative Fabrica, my one-stop shop. Um, and I will link that in the description of this video tutorial as well. So I'm going to show you how to utilize this PLR digital camera. Uh, I said camera. Digital calendar. It's so easy to say camera because we've been doing digital cameras forever. Now we're doing all these digital images and things like that. So anywho, um, as you can see here in Etsy, she um, tells you that you can change the color scheme to match your brand with um, this area here. And then you can add your image. All you'll do is just drag your image into this um, open frame. And then you can change the font that's on the words and um, pretty much make it your own. Okay, so she's done all of the work for you. All you need to do is have access to Canva and you're good to go. Okay, so when you purchase this file, and you download it, it's going to actually take you to where you can click on a link. And when you click on that link, it's going to bring you into Canva. Okay, so I'm going to show you what that's going to look like here. Give me one second. All right, so when you download it, it's going to look like this. And you're going to have this purple area here. This is a, a hyperlink. So when you click it, it's going to take you to the 11 by 8 and a half um, camera calendar that's been put together for you. I don't know why I want to say camera. All right. So when you click that link, it's going to bring you directly into Canva. That's why I say you have to have access to Canva. All right. So this is the um, template for all 12 months of the year. Okay. And so you're going to have your primary page here. And so I'm going to go over to uploads in Canva and I'm going to upload this image as my primary page. You see how I just dragged and dropped it in. That's all you're going to do. Now I use the aspect ratio of 18 by six or 18 to six because I want my images to slide in this area right here without chopping off the head, okay? So if I take that same four to five ratio image and put it here, you see how it cuts off a little bit more of the, the head and you know we want it to look really, really nice. So I'm going to be using these 18 um, by six aspect ratio images in this area, okay? Hopefully that makes sense. Now, these little areas right here, you can change the color to match your brand. And you can also add text directly in there. So I can type directly into this space. You can change the font. You can make it bigger or smaller, you know, fold it, whatever you want to do in that area. Okay. Um, and this is where you can click to change the color to whatever you want it to be. Let me click back on here and go here sorry about that and then click there okay so we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you how we're gonna design this with these beautiful grandmothers and I think this digital cam calendar is going to be beautiful with all these very beautiful grandmothers all right so just think about a time a special time that you had with your grandmother my grandmother was beautiful she had long pretty gray hair 
and very light, fair skin like these ladies. So, and she wore glasses too. So these ladies remind me of my grandmother. The only exception is my grandma. My grandmother had very long, pretty, silky hair. All right, so we're gonna start dropping these images in, guys. So I'm just gonna start here. And you see how I get a little bit more real estate or of her face using these 18 to six ratio um, images that I created using Midjourney's Discord server. So I'm gonna drop the images in first so that I don't, I'm gonna try not to duplicate. I'm good with duplicating. I get to something, I'm like, oh, I already used that. All right, so I'm gonna go to the next one. And all I'm gonna do is click the image and just drag it over. And it'll fall right into place, as you can see here. So I'm gonna go to my next one. All the hard work has been done for us guys. With these, all we have to do is just drop our images right on in. So I'm gonna continue to add my grandmothers in here. I'm gonna go back and get this one. And if you start to see where your image, like this is a good one, where your image is getting too close to where you're gonna have your text or slogan or whatever you wanna put in there, just click the image and come here and say flip and then flip it horizontal. So you'll put the grandmother closer to the right edge than the left edge. So we got that and we're gonna go to our next one and our next one. These grandmothers are beautiful. They are beautiful. Oops, I dragged that one wrong. Okay, come on now. Maybe that, that, that one don't wanna play with us today. All right, that grandmother didn't want to participate in the project, so we're just going to leave her on over there. Let her just, you know, think about her actions today. <laughs> that sounds like something my grandmother would say. <laughs> I'm just let you sit in that corner and think about your actions today. All right, so now I have these slogans that I brought from Creative Fabrica, these graphic, these are graphic images. So I'm going to take them and I'm going to plop them into this area and possibly change the color just to match whatever my primary color is in my image. And it's all going to look beautiful. So I'm just going to click the image, right, because we don't want to drag and drop um, because it's not going to plop into that area. It's going to plop into that area and we don't want to do that, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put the image here like that, and then I'm just gonna move it up to get it to fit nicely in there. So we got always believe, and that looks good in the impossible. All right, I'm gonna go to the next one, which is be happy. And I'm just going to kind of send it in there, and then I'm gonna move it upward. So we're just gonna shift those corners till we get it nicely inside. And then uh, let's see, I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna do the pink on that one. That'll be pretty. Let me get it nice and centered. All right, so we got be happy. Now we're gonna do the be kind. And if it if it shifts, just don't let it go, guys. Just kind of, uh, you know, get a oh, oops. I'm dragging my months. Don't want to drag my months in there. All right, so we're gonna have to really work with that one because it was super big. And again, we want to make sure it shows in there nicely centered. And then. Just kind of play with it a little bit. And on this one, I'm going to go with that yellowish color again. I think that'll bring that out. And then we're going to choose happy. We should all choose happy, guys. All of us should choose happy. All right. I'm going to move that right in there. 
And again, I'm going to link both uh, the PLR template and also um, and also the the file from Creative Fabrica. So if I had this where I could just drag that right on in, then I would really be cooking with gas because I would I would be like, all right, girl, you got it now. You got it. You got it. But it's very easy, as you can see here. I did. Don't give up. Next, we're going to do dream it. Just dream. Okay. Now, you don't have to change these colors. I'm changing them just to show you, but you can leave the color um, gray. You don't have to change the color. Okay, I won't move that one. I'm going to do a little blue right there. And the last one we did was dream it, wish it. You know what? I'm going to bring make that a little bit lighter. We're going to do blue on that one. All right, so we got dream it, wish it, do it. And then we're going to do I can and I will. These, um, the reason I chose these, um, these graphics were because it sounded like something our grandmothers would have said at some point in time, right? You know, to motivate you or to inspire you. So I thought it was so befitting for this digital ca uh, calendar to to have these little phrases like this. All right, so we got a can and I will. Now we're going to come down and say, I decide my vibe. That's That looks like what this grandmother would have told me. I decide my vibe. All right, we're going to fit that in there. Look at that, guys. We're already on August. And you know it would have took us forever to put this calendar together if it was not a PLR digital template. All right. So, like I said, you can get these on Etsy. And this one is um, going to be linked in the description here for you. And, all right. So, we got out of my vibe. I don't know why I keep wanting to put this on the previous um previous one. I'm gonna click here. All right, we're almost done. Almost done. I'm just shrinking these down. I'm gonna go back to my yellow oldish color. All right, and. This one, we're going to do Know Your Worth. Definitely got to have that in there. We need to all know our worth. Okay. And let's see. I'm going to go with kind of pinkish color. I love pink. All right, we're on November. We're almost done. Open your mind. What's some of the things your grandmother used to tell you or say to you? Put that in the comments. See if we got some of the same, if our grandmothers were saying some of the same things, which I'm pretty sure they were. Um, I used to laugh because my grandmother used to say, go up yonder, go down yonder. <laughs> my god all right let's see we're gonna do yes you can do it all right i'm just gonna drag this down because i just want to keep adding it to the previous to the previous slide for some reason all right we're gonna make that there and we're done we got all 12 months up in you now let's take a look at our work and make sure we didn't duplicate anything. So we're gonna make that large. Look how beautiful she is. Hey, she's beautiful. My grandmother used to wear the big hats at, on Sunday and 
She was beautiful. All right, so we got always believe in the impossible. Then we have be happy, be kind, be brave, be honest. I could move that one over a little bit. Choose happy, because she looks happy. Don't give up. Dream it, wish it, do it. I can and I will. I decide my vibe. I can do it. Know your worth and open your mind. Yes, you can do it. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. All right. So I would highly recommend that you save your file. Um, and that way you can just come back. And all you have to do is just change out the images. That's it guys you don't have to do any additional work unless you choose to right so that is how you use this 2024 digital calendar um, template that is created here i'm going to go back to her etsy shop um, by our own precious precious delights for you and for those that are in my Facebook group, Ken Doris is Cricket and Creative Crafters. This is one of our own Facebook group members. So um, this is Tara. So give her a shout out in the group when you see her, but she does amazing work. So check her shop out on Etsy. I'm going to link the PLR um, digital calendar template for you if you choose to purchase that but she does amazing work out here both illustrations templates clip art ai art the girl is bad okay all right guys that's my story i'm sticking to it if you are currently in my facebook group i want to thank you guys just like tara thank you guys so much for being in my group um, if you would like to join my facebook group it is called ken doris's cricket and creative crafters all you have to do is um, click on the link in my um, in the description of this video tutorial and agree to the Facebook group rules and you are in my friend okay and then if you are currently subscribed to my YouTube channel I want to thank you guys so much for subscribing to my YouTube channel and if you're seeing me for the first time and you like my method of teaching, um, then please like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel as well, because the more, the merrier, right? And I have over 500 video tutorials on my YouTube channel showing you how to do a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> All right. All right, guys, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. You guys know my motto is each one reach one so that each one can teach one. And you guys have an amazing day. Bye.